Okay, I'll admit it. I'm a little bit stumped. This is day two on this plumbing project here. Uh, yesterday I spent about three and a half hours trying to unclog this line. Okay, so this is the sink in question right here. As you can see, it's a double sink. Um, garbage disposal connected to it. And, uh, and also the dishwasher connected to the garbage disposal. This guy right here, uh, it's, a, the, it's a one and a half inch PVC connected to a two inch um, cast iron pipe that goes that goes down to that pipe that I just showed you, that drain pipe. Uh, so this guy actually veers to the left and then shoots down to that T, I believe. I can't really tell because I don't know what's behind the wall. But it's an educated guess. I can almost see if you can look through that picture right there. It does veer to the left in the direction that I expect that drain line to be at. So, uh, just so you guys can see what I'm trying to combat here. And this guy is shooting up, just will not drain. So, let's we'll see what we got. So, I went ahead and removed the clean out. This clean out there, that clean out right here. This clean out is the one that goes out to the, uh, the catch basin outside so the way this plumbing is connected is we have this line right here that goes out to the sump pump sump pump takes it pumps it out from here shoots it up goes around that trap comes around this way comes down out to the drain out to the catch basin right here underneath this T which I you can see here that T goes up to the sink in the kitchen I believe I'm not entirely sure I haven't broke the ceiling yet to see yet but uh, I believe that that's the that's where the um, the drain for the uh, kitchen sink is this guy over here I'm not exactly sure where this goes out to I couldn't find it up on the second on the first floor but I did take out this clean out plug ran the rod or the snake whatever you want to call it, the rodder through the pipe Cleared all of this out. A lot of gunk came out of this entire line. It was completely clogged and coming down all the way out to the uh, the catch basin. All of this was full of gunk. And I still can't get this line to unclog. I just can't get the snake to go through the bend and work its way up into that, um, that line. Also, from the kitchen, no matter how many times I run that snake through there, I can't run the snake down and it won't clear out that T. So I was thinking about this last night, and I said to myself, you know, there's got to be a got to be a way to 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 run the snake just through this particular line here, which I think that right there is where the problem's at. So I came up with this small idea here. So I'm gonna go ahead and open up a hole right here in the middle of the team, where it goes up to the uh, to the sink up in the kitchen. I'm gonna open up a one and one eighth inch hole with a normal hole saw. So this is what I'm gonna use. This guy, a little bimetal hole dozer, one and one eighth of an inch. After I run that one and one eighth of an inch hole, I'm gonna go ahead and, after I'm done rotting it, I'm gonna, I'm gonna rod that hole out. I'm gonna rod it out going up to the sink and then I'm gonna plug this up. I found this in Pet Boys. One and one eighth to one and a quarter inch expanding tight plug deal thing anyways that's what i'm going to use to plug up that hole that i'm going to put up there so and uh just in case so this might be crazy of me but uh, i'm going to try it anyways i brought my uh pressure washer so i'm going to stick the rod up the um, the snake up into that hole after i stick the snake up in there i'm going to shove the pressure washer nozzle in there and try and see if i can pressure wash as much of the gunk out of there okay so here's the t I can see that uh, there's like a 45 or whatever degree angle that goes up to the top. It's not straight up. So I'm going to try and I'm going to start with a pilot hole in the general direction of where that line is right here. I'll start with the pilot hole and then I'll bring up the hole saw. You did it, dude. 
Let's see what we got in there. Want a flashlight? So I want to see. Huh? I wonder if I can turn on the light here. Nope. Yeah, we'll look, at, look at that. All completely plugged up. Ain't nothing getting through there. Good. That's exactly what the problem was. So I'm gonna go ahead and run the snake through there. I'm gonna hit it with the pressure washer first. All right, actually, we're gonna run it with the snake first and then the pressure washer. Can you run? Oh, I see. You run the snake up through there. Uh huh. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna put this plug back on. Let's see if I can focus on this guy. So this is that plug I so I got from Pet Boys. Let's put that in there. I had to expand it first a little bit. I don't think it's gonna focus on me. My screen is wet. Ah, you can see anyways. Um, I had to expand it a little bit before I can put it in the hole because it was just sliding in and I couldn't uh, get any grip on it. So. I'm, I'm gonna go, I need two hands to do this. I'm gonna hold this base, turn that nut, and it should expand to hold it in place. And that leaking should stop. All right, so I timed that guy up until the dripping stopped. I'm gonna go upstairs and test the, uh, test, uh, see if I still got a clog or not. Okay, so uh, it looks like from downstairs, uh, after pressure washing the, the line, getting all that gunk out, man, what a mess downstairs. Gotta go clean that up. But um, so I went ahead and filled up the sink over here and they say that if you have uh, good drainage that it should drain faster than it fills. So I'm going to go ahead and turn the water on and take the plugs out over here and uh, this guy should drain completely while it's filling. Uh, let's see what we got here. Looks like it's draining pretty good. going all right that side's good turn on the garbage disposal oh I disconnected it but it's going anyways there it is all right all right looks like um Looks like we cleared the clog. Fantastic. So um, there you go. If, if you have any questions for me, go ahead and uh, send it up on Facebook. Or if you have any better suggestions or to tell me what I could have done differently or better, let me know too. I'm, I'm, I'm open for uh, any suggestions. By the way, I have a lot of cleanup to do. All right, guys. Cleanup's done. I'm going home.